Hi guys. So I don't have a computer. <laughs> My computer broke. So I have an iPad, but I can't figure out how to get it to to edit movies. So I will work on that this weekend. That is my number one goal because I have like three movies in the can that I cannot get to you. It is, uh, oh my God, my nose. Mm. My nose is running from the allergies. Oh my God, so I had an OBE last night. Um, it was a really short one, but it was crazy. I was, um, when I went out of body, I was listening to this meditation thing. Um, I, I'll link it below because it was all about like um, other worlds, like going to other worlds. It was really cool. So I left my body, and since then, I've felt a little like crazy, like a little still, like a piece of me still there or something. I know that's weird, but I'm telling you. But anyway, I left my body and sat up in my bed. I was there in my bed. I was not out of my room. And instead of when I went to bed, I had I had um, closed the um, a curtain to my window and I had shut the window and closed the curtain because I have a little fan right now that's in my window like it's just a little one and uh, it was bringing cool air in because it had warmed up in the afternoon so it was like bringing in cool air which I love a fan I love the noise of a fan I enjoy a fan uh, my dogs hate it so cozy kept getting snotty and sneezing and gagging and I was like oh she's got allergies like this wind or the wind is just bothering her that much so <clears throat> so I turned off the fan and closed the window and shut the curtain lay down started my meditation routines found this new one went ahead with that and right away went out of body and when I went out of body I sat up in my bed and I looked at the window and the curtain was back open and I was like what am I supposed to see like in my mind that's what I said like what am I supposed to see that the curtain was open because I remembered closing it in you know my other the life that this body lives in so I I stand up and I peer out the window and there's a guy I know on a bike and he is trying first he's trying to um, there's a van that sits out of my bedroom window that's been there since 2013 yeah long story but anyway he was trying to get in to the back of the van and I was just watching him. My light was on. It was my house. It was my neighbor's yard. Like, it was everything looked the same. So, I'm just, like, watching him, like, kind of fascinated. Like, what is he doing? So, he's pulling on the back door of the van. Now, in real life, hold on, I'm going to sneeze and I can't edit it out. Oh, my allergies are so bad. In real life... Um, the van has a bunch of bees in it, okay? So, but in, you know, I don't know if that's true on the plane I'm now in. So, I'm just like fascinated watching. So, he pops open the back of the van and it comes open. And he goes through and in the van, there's no bees. Because I waited to see, are there bees in it on this side? No bees. Or if they are, they're dead or whatever, cold, whatever bees do. And they don't show. So, I'm just like watching through my window. And he starts pulling stuff out onto the lawn. Like, um, tools and a tire, a spare tires, stuff like that. So, I'm like, oh, okay. Uh, he's going to rob it. And then he looks up and sees me. And I know who this person is, by the way. This is somebody who I tried to hire and had around my house for a little while. And they uh, proved themselves very disloyal. And I, I had...
had to undo the good I had done with him because I tried to get him to work for me because he was down on his luck, but it was all just bullshit and he turned out to be like a junkie. So, uh, or I don't know if he was a junkie. He turned out to be doing drugs. I'll say that because I don't know if he was a junkie or not, truthfully. I didn't get that far. The minute I smelled it, I was like, done, not smelled it. I mean, the minute I sniffed out that there was something wrong, it was over. So that's the person. And so I don't know if he still lives around here. I've never seen him. I've seen him like once or twice, like right in the beginning when I first let him go, but not since, like for months and months and months. So, um, so he sees me, he stops what he's doing and he looks up and sees that I'm looking right at him and he gets this really angry face on and uh, like my belly went like, <gasps> like tight and scared and he, you can get to my, like my window on the side, you can get to, you can like go right through it if you wanted to because I'm a single floor house. So he takes like two steps towards the window and I grab the curtain and close it like this and he comes through it, but he's not, um, he's not like walking or climbing he's like kind of floating through it and I was like oh my god he's out of body and boom back in my body I jump up I leap up I look out the window it's all quiet and I was just like whoa it took me a bit of time to get to sleep I kept hearing things and I would jump up and look like, it, it unsettled me. And I don't think he's any kind of a threat here. At least here. You know, I hope. Anyway, I, I just don't think so. Uh, but, you know. And that was the end of the OBA. But it was unsettling as fuck. Like, he just, like, floated through the curtain. I was like, <gasps> like he's in my house. And then I, can't, I, like, fear always does it. Fear pops you back in your body. So I wonder if there's a message or if there's like something. I've never encountered somebody like, did I, that I knew. Yeah, I guess I have. I guess I've seen people I've known on the other side. But usually they're in different variants of their life. Like they don't look like they do now or they something like where I'm observing them. And I guess I was observing at first until he caught me observing. And then it was all different ballgame. But, yeah, that was a bit creepy. Gotta be honest. That was creepy as fuck. I made sure my security system was on this morning when I left. <laughs> Don't mess with my little doggies. So, Cozy's doing good. She's still on the meds. So, we won't know until we take her off in about another, I think, seven, six or seven days. Um, Piper's getting her hair cut tonight. I have a meeting when I get to work. I've got to do payroll and then I'm out. I got to run home, grab Piper, take her to the groomer, run over, grab my son, take him to his car to pick his car up, wait, go back, get Piper from the groomer, go home, clean my house up. I mean, my house is pretty clean. I have not had the housekeepers back, and that's a story in itself, but um, I'm going to go ahead and clean myself for the rest of the weekend, before the weekend comes, and then uh, they're supposed to be here the following week. Um, guy's got to come and do my yard, but he's had a hell of a time with this weather, and came once last week but like it took him two weeks to get there because we have had nothing but rain let me tell you what this is like Seattle weather here which is crazy but anyway I'm gonna cut off now sorry the video I can't edit right now so I'm doing the best I can with videos I've got three other videos waiting to that one is stuck in an editing file that froze and I can't get open because my computer's fucked up <laughs> 
and I can't seem to fix it. So I'm just going to use the iPad and see what I can do with all that. I still have the raw footage, thank God. And I'm just going to directly stick that on YouTube, this that you're watching on YouTube, just to explain what's going on so you don't think I'm crazy and left you. If this interrupts, then I'm sorry. I'm just going to stick it on the way it is. But anyway, that's the way it is. I love you guys. Bye. Have a good weekend. Have a good weekend. Bye.